Degu? What? That's a team? That is awesome. South Korea. That just makes me all sorts of happy inside. Sporting, Srem, Birmingham, Madrid, Malaga, Hercules! Wow. Where are you guys from? Spain! It's just lovely. League 2, Spain. Uh, that just makes me all sorts of happy inside. Comfortable 3 1 win. The journeyman striker Tim Sills. Uh, let me go ahead and show you what I mean. If we look at. Uh, we don't want team depth. Looking for something. Vince? Oh. Oh my goodness. It just records everything, doesn't it? Jobs, contract, shortlist, search. Information. There was somewhere. I can always find this stuff when I'm not looking for it. What are the facts about our team? Tallest player, Tim Sills. Shortest player, Zola. Average age, 24. So if you look at uh, our team versus the Blue Square Bet Premier Team, Cam Grimshaw is actually our youngest player. Wow. We do not have the oldest player in the league. We do not have the tallest, nor do we have the shortest. Our average height is just a little bit below average for the league. But we are on target with the age. Lightest player at Dolly at 70, Andy Welsh at AFC Wimbledon. 10 kilograms lighter, that's quite considerable. Heaviest player, Brandon Hall. There's Matt Reed. Average weight for our team is 1 kilogram more than the entire league. Lovely. Our top earner is not as much as Manfield's top earner, by a lot. Lowest earner. Well, we have non-applicable for the non-contract people. Average salary is well below the league. Highest caps, I'm not sure what that is, which we don't have, so that's probably why I don't know what it is. Domestic player bias, 86%. We have more foreign players than most of the league. We represent eight nationalities, 36 total represented in the entire league. That's awesome. Your 15 days tenure. Cool! Where is our records? Records are somewhere. Bet they're in the boardroom, aren't they? Oh. Club view team. Oh, hello. We're here now. Interesting. We are $500 over budget. That reminds me, actually, before we continue. Go to finances, change budgets, goodbye transfer budget. That'll help a little. Some, yeah. Now we're only seventy-five dollars over budget, so that's not as bad. Boardroom. I could have sworn it was in the boardroom. Aha! Uh -huh. That's why I knew it was in the boardroom. Here we go. Okay. So, team records. A lot of these were made last year. But, uh, this is just everything as a whole. The team, highest league position, the Blue Square Bet South was fourth. Lowest in the English Ithnian League, P, in 1999. Basing Stoke was 18. Highest attendance in November of 1997. Basing Stoke played against Blackcombe. And they had 5,000 people attending that match. These are actually like legitimate stats. At least these two are. This one I changed last year. It was fifth. I made it fourth. 
Um, but these are actually real stats. The, the older stuff, this is real. Biggest win, 10-1. Biggest defeat, 8-0. I don't know if that's... But the rest of these are... Uh, those are the only stats that are still real. The rest of these are now fake. Highest gate receipts, lowest attendance was against Maidenhead. That's when we were winning a lot. Nobody, like, cared. <laughs> Longest winning streak, 7. Most games without losing, 17. 7 games without winning. Most games with a shutout, 4. If we look at player records, which is what I wanted to show you guys, actually. Top goal scorer, 27 goals. 20 in the entire league. Three, gil three goals in one match by Tim Sills, who 3-1 over Sutton United. That was a beautiful day. Most assists, 12 by Magali. Highest average rating and 54 appearances with 7.4 Ross Adams. 13 of those appearances was player of the match, Mr. Adams. You can see why I want to keep him. He is just scary good despite what the stats say. Worst discipline, Dolly, 10 yellow cards last season. There's a chance that could be overtaken this season with how many fouls we're starting with. It's kind of scary. Most league appearances for the club, 302 from Jason Bristow. Most league goals for the club, however, 65 for Tim Sills. He's been doing phenomenally. Our youngest player was, uh, he made his debut, Mr. Grant Mills, at 16 years and 53 days versus Leatherhead in the FA Cup fourth qualifying round. It was the, the debut day for Mr. Mills. It was quite a glorious day as we won that match by, I think, one point. Our oldest player being 41 years old, 30 days before he left us, his last game, Mr. Ashley Bays against Hazen Yetting in the playoff semi or the playoff finals to get us into the uh, premiere, Blue Scorbet premiere. Ashley Bays got us there. He was really old. We now have a good transfer fee, fee twenty thousand uh, dollars. Total transfer spending. We have beaten at $40,000 with no income whatsoever. Fans Player of the Year, Ross Adams. Fastest goal, 1 minute 8 seconds by Ross Adams versus Hazen Yenning. Youngest goal scorer, Grant Mills. About 133 days after his debut, he made his first goal against Biller K. I believe they were relegated. Oldest goal scorer, Tim Sills versus Kelmsford. That will change this year, as he will be approaching 34 years old. And he will still be playing for Basingstoke. I want to double check. You guys are relegated, right? No, they finished 21st. It's not a red circle, so I don't think they were relegated. They might have been relegated. They haven't played any matches, so there's actually a good chance they were relegated. They were doing really poorly last season, so... Too bad for them, but that, I'm not really caring too much about them. $75 over budget. 75 Why can't I make that up so I, I tried getting rid of players. I have. Truly. I've tried dumping players from the first team. Doesn't work. So everyone's feeling good going into this Blackford game. Which is good, because I believe Blackford is a championship level team. And they're going to crush us. Ole, 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 ole. Ole chips. Ole lots of things. Joe Devera. Do I care? Not really. Apparently he's famous, but I have no idea who he is. Ah, uh, fine. Press conference. I'm pleased the opportunity has been presented to us. 
Nim Squad joins what's already a large team. Some fans concerned you risk the club's financial future by continuing stretching the payroll budget in this way. What would you say to those critics? <laughs> so concentrate more on supporting the team. Let me do my job. You do your job, please. <laughs> I'm given a payroll budget to spend by the board. If they were unhappy with how I do that, do you really think I'd be sat here with Liam? Seriously? Come on, guys. Liam Grimshaw was released from Manchester United, having failed to make the breakthrough there. Do you see something in perhaps the others have missed? Well, let's see. We're a Blue Square Bet Premier Team. They are a Premier League team. There are at least three leagues separating the two leagues, which is a five-league difference. I think that is, in of itself, a good representation. <laughs> I'm surprised he was released. Not really, at all. Uh, I, I don't think you should expect to see much else from the club in the way of signings. There was a transfer budget to spend. No players need to leave well, because of that. I spent the transfer budget. I just decided to spend it on some player salary instead of transfer salary. Ah, uh, I was surprised that he was released. Crazy anyways. He didn't seem to... Oh, excuse me. Wow. He didn't seem to care. That's okay. He played a 7.0 game. That's always good to see. What's even better to see is like every time I, s I scroll over his name, I'm just I'm giddy. Seeing how many blue numbers there are, I'm just always giddy every time I scroll over his name. But I got someone this good on the team. And at such a young age. He's our youngest... Well, he is not our youngest player. He is our youngest player who also has lots of blue, but that's because we've trained him endlessly. Crazy lots of training for him. Uh, Mr. Dobson. On a youth contract. Jim Williams. I... You are available for loans, sir. It's valued at 1000 on a youth contract. I want Mr. Williams to offer him on loan till the end of the season for a salary of 10% of his salary. So currently monthly contribution $34. So proposed wage contribution $8 per week. $8. Can anyone afford $8? Dollars on loan, offer him out to clubs. I just want him to get some play time, and I know he's not going to get it if he stays at Basingstoke. Even if he plays in the under 18s, he's not going to get it because he's not that good right now, unfortunately. I wish he was better, but he, he's not. We have a lot of midfielders. Dobson. I already offered Dobson. No one wanted Dobson. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Yes, we, we saw that. In fact, we were there. Who would have thought? Well, I have faith in this Basingstoke team. I actually looked up images of Basingstoke. And... They... it's a, a beautiful place. I believe it's a city inside of a county in England. And when you look at some pictures, it looks like England. But you look at some of the other pictures of some of the stuff that's actually in Basing, in and around Basingstoke, it's beautiful. It's, a, it's just absolutely, stunningly beautiful place. Oh, their Blackburn is not championship, they're... Premier. <laughs> oh, we're 
we're so boned. Wonderful. Anyways, but no, Basingstoke is a really beautiful place. I actually want to visit there sometime. Cause that, that looked nice. I'm probably going to go around and visit like all of the places where all of these England teams are from. I'm getting attached to all of them, even the ones I'm not playing. Blackburn, that's cool. Uh, Swindon, the Wolves, I mean, it's Bristol City, Liverpool. Out of it is Liverpool. Actually, pretty big. JL. And I have no idea what some of these are. We are just beyond screwed. If we can pull any goal out of this game, I will be un honestly like blown away. Yeah. They've only played one game though, so we have match fitness on them. Like that's gonna help. Ross Adams almost ready to come back in. Returning to full fitness in three days, being rested for three days. <laughs> Dang it. McDonald in for Horner. Let him rest some. Playing the crap out of Booker. But I think we should play Dolly, so he can get some match fitness, and so Booker can rest a little bit. Sills, yeah, you need to play, you need match fitness. Yep. I don't know what I want to do. Have any players not at the club? I do not. Alright. Whoop. Not that button. We're getting ready to go into the next game.